to carry. Michael Riley with the tackle for Edison. The middle, in between the A and the B gaps for, for Newport Harbor. That's no just game not on the play. It's not going to be second down. I understand you have to call it to keep them honest, but you're down 14 nothing already to start this game, and it doesn't look like you're going to be able to stop uh, Kobe Lopez from running the football at all tonight. So you, they, they got to go to the air and do what they do best. With three wide, Newport Harbor has a second and 10 at their own 20 yard line. 2.45 to go. First quarter, they're down 14 0. Lavin throws a slant. It's behind McCoy and drops. Lavin's pass intended for Justin McCoy falls incomplete. Third down. The quarterback and also McCoy leaking out the backfield. That's just a bad pass, though. Man, he's wide open. He goes by it once again. Edison has very aggressive linebackers, so you can sneak backs at out, out on a triangle route, or you can run the tight end up the seam on a fake block type pattern uh, on a play action play. You can get by the linebacker, he's wide open. If he puts that on the numbers, that kid's still running. McCoy is still in there along with Seward. Lavin is the quarterback who takes the snap, a drop of three, throws a quick comeback route, and it's nearly intercepted by Palmer, but a flag has been thrown. That's back off. Pass is incomplete. Penalty that's, marker that's, that's on the field. Like From the start of that play, he's in his face. He's up in his mix. He plays that pattern perfectly. Breaks on the ball. He reaches around him. I'm trying to figure now if they call holding, then I can, I don't have an arm. But if you're calling pass interference, that's not passing. Pass interference, interference penalty that's against the Chargers. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, that's not pass interference. He did break on the. That's yes. that's what you call comeback speed, right? Yeah, absolutely. You got to be able to break back on the ball. You want to be able to break back to the football and, and meet the, the result of the penalty moves the ball to so the Sailors 35 yard line. It's like first down said, Newport that ball is as much as mine as it is yours. It's not my job to let you catch it and then make the tackle. Yep. I'm going to go get the football too. I love when Deion Sanders says on his NFL game day prime, he talks about how some corners just played not to get beat. Yeah, he played always to beat the receiver. To beat the receiver absolutely. That's Isaiah Palmer. The penalty shooter, marker the on the field. 5'8", 175, False start penalty against the Sailors. Not bad numbers. Not at all. Not at all. And he's not a big. And he's not a big corner. He's not today. Today we fall in love with the. The, the, the result the of the penalty moves the ball back to the 30-yard line. The Patrick Peters first down the and 15. Six one, six two, long, lanky. But we forget. You got guys like in the NFL, like Xavier Howard in Miami, who really came out of nowhere and is one of the better corners in the gotta league. Slip him in there. I got slip to. The Dolphins, yeah. yep. well, we'll talk Michigan later, oh, too, right, man. Right, you, right. If you think I'm not slipping my squad, then <laughs> y'all hired the wrong guy. <laughs> you're right. You're right. I, wa I want the fans to know who I cheer for. Oh, man, I think they've heard it a time or two. Yeah, maybe. Well, you always bring it up, so. Uh, I guess. You know. I mean, Pass left the bell, and he has wrapped up off a gain of six. The tackle by guess who? Lance Isaiah Bell with the yeah. reception. That's a good way to come back off the pass interference. That Isaiah was Palmer with the tackle. Set up second and nine. And you notice off that play, I think the pass interference is scared. He plays seven yard gain on the play. Right now, you see him, he's playing a little. Brings up second little, down uh, and eight. Back off coverage, he's playing a little zone coverage, not up in his face like he wants to be. Sometimes those flags scare young guys, and maybe the coach might have, you know, gave him the temple point, tell him to think. But I'd, I'd still get right back up in his face. Stay pressure. Yeah, you'd rather as a player try and make some plays and maybe get penalized a time or two than take no chance. Absolutely. Right? So with three wide, Newport Harbor has a second and eight. That's the throw, fires an outcut right and finds his go-to target. Aiden Goltz breaks a tackle and Fletcher. That's a that's a fumble. Down. That's a fumble. That's a fumble. They're gonna they're gonna say he's down, but pass is complete to Aiden Goltz. That ball looked like it was out. Too bad when I'm replaying high school. That ball looked like it was Marcus out. Pittman with the tackle. That beat me. I didn't see it. Sailors didn't have see the ball in the Edison 49-yard line. First down and 10. They call me Eagle Eye, man. My my man. friends, I'll tell you, man, my friends and my wife always try to tell me I'm blind because I wear glass. I said, man, <laughs> I'm like Shaq with his free throws. He says, I make him when I need him. I see what I need to see. Oh, that's true. Yeah, I see what I need to see. Eagle Eye. Is there any guy in the NBA named VJ? Not one. Oh, that's why. You're one of a kind, huh? <laughs> Not one. <laughs> Getting full of yourself over uh, here, man. No, man. I'm Put you in check. Well, I'm hungry, so I had to... That's I, true. That's true. Got to eat myself. Here's a pass that's knocked up in the line and incomplete. As Luke Overbase... Paul Lavin's pass is tipped the at the line of scrimmage. Tonight senior night. The Chargers... Uh, getting Luke Overbay with the pressure. Season game out the way. The final two games will be on the road. Uh, the Chargers.